All right, I'll quickly show you how to uh, attach um, other types of limbs to starter rigs. So first install starter rigs by going edit preferences and go to add-ons and install that add-on. Just select the zip file and then you're good to go. Then just go here and then just add the starter 2.0 rig, which is the one I'm using right now because I'm going to attach stick master Luke and go file import wavefront OBJ, the new one. Um, I, I assigned a, sh a shortcut, which is control and then down arrow. Um, and then you just want to go to the um, character that you want. So I'm just going to go stick master loop. Now you can't see my screen, but just select split by group. Um, if you it, it, check the right and then I'll see in the option split by group. So enable that and go import wavefront OBJ, as you can see. Um, you can also go to texture and then you can see the textures. Very nice. Now you want a texture on this rig, so you just want to go here and then just choose the um, stick master. No, that's the wrong one. There you go. Uh, the face doesn't seem to work, so I'll go here. All right, there you go. Now it works fine. Um, let me check. What's the difference between these? Okay, so this one doesn't have any hands. This one does. Okay, so I'll do this one. Then you'll need to um, do these accessories as well. Fix the materials up a bit. 0.5, and then do here. 0 0.5, 0 0.5. There you go. Um, and I just want to hold this and hold shift here join since they, these are both hats so you just want to attach that and go here and then go inside the head uh, just um, if you if you want the shortcut just go f3 and then go walk navigation and then just right click on this and then um, change the shortcut to shift f as i've done it so now it's easier to move inside the head um, or what you can do is just move the head right here and then you can just click this hold shift press this control p and then object keep transform there you go and just go back here and then the head bone works fine if you want the head bone to be a bit bigger what you can do is you can go here vapor display click on this and then hold it down hold 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 on it and then just go down with your mouse and then just scale this up a bit if you need to and then as you can see the head bone will there and 2.0 release you can just do it in the add-on very simple um uh, you can also do it with the stretcher bone if you need to so it's easier to stretch as you can see um, the wings uh, fix the materials on the wings it seems to be already fixed then just go here and then just alt G and then just go here and then go to pose mode right there and then just select this bone and then go control P and then bone now this process will be way simpler with the new starter rx 2.0 add-on you can just click on it but that's that's in the future anyways as you can see now it works fine now you can delete all these and it does not matter you cannot see the face either so that does not matter uh, now what you need to do is attach these cu custom limbs so what you want to do is you want to move this right here uh, holding control and then G and then X or you can just press alt G that works now what you want to do is go here be sure to not be sure to be on the basis shape key and press tab then go to modifiers then select this little thingy right there there you go now press alt s there you go and then just scale it until it doesn't clip anymore just check that nothing clips there you go and then what you want to do is you want to go here and then go to viewport display and wire and then what you want to do is you want to press on this then go to um, edit mode you want to press a and then m and then by distance then you want to do alt N, oh wait, sorry, <laughs> Alt J, there you go. Now you want to go here to trust the quads and press compare UVs. There you go. So the UVs don't glitch out. And um, then you want to go here and go to mesh deform, which will deform it to the mesh, which is the right leg. Bind it so it um, knows what to copy. And then if you try it now, let's go to Posmo. You can scale these bones if needed so uh, you can actually see them and then rotate them if you don't have time to do that just press this and you can see um, everything if it's even clipping um, but yeah as you can see it works fine same with the foot you can also just do this and then you can see the bones there you go works fine and um, yeah that's basically how you can do it um, and you can do the same on the other limb as well i won't do that just to save time what you want to do now is you want to just put this in a new collection so i'll just go m and then i'll go here and then go starter rigs 2.0 new collection and i'll just put it uh oh wait no you can actually do an easier one sorry 
M starter, and then you could just put in the shapes. There you go. Simple. You can also put these in that collection right there. So whenever you're appending, you can just append this collection and it works fine. There you go. And um, that's pretty much it. Hope you um, hope this video helped you out and see you in a later one. If you need more tutorials, check out this channel. We have all the tutorials needed on starter rakes, on animation, basically everything to do with Roblox art. All right, see ya.